In this video, I unbox the future of television. Sky Q is an entirely new TV platform from Sky. It combines regular satellite TV channels with downloadable catch-up and VOD, as well as network streaming. At the heart of the system is this Sky Q silver receiver. I asked the man behind Sky Q what Q actually stood for. He said it just sounded cool, which was fair enough. Like Sky Plus, the silver box is a PVR and has a 2TB hard drive. 300 gig is reserved by Sky for push content. As you can see, it's very slim and has a shiny silver trim. Here's the Q logo, which glows blue. There's also power and WPS for connecting Sky routers and Sky Q mini boxes. The viewing card's on the side. No flaps here. So on to the rear. Things are pretty clean. There's no room for legacy AV. There's a digital optical audio out, covered Ethernet jack, twin USBs. Besides the HDMI output is a covered second HDMI. There's also a twin dish feed. On the underside we have a small fan. Because this is the future, Sky Q is ready for 4K services and there's the promise of a firmware update to enable HDR. If you prise off the rubber bung, it reveals an HDMI input. The box is Apple AirPlay compliant as well as Bluetooth enabled. There are 12 tuners on board and you can record 4 channels at once. Another big change is the remote control. This is the SkyQ Touch. It's a Bluetooth controller with a touchpad. It also has a built-in mic, but that's not activated yet. There are Sky and Home buttons, which replace the old planner. You swipe to navigate. There are transport controls and the record button. This is quite different from the old Sky Remote. So what else do we have in the box? There's a power lead. And there's an HDMI cable. We have attractive color coding. Sky Cute. Just to get a sense of how small the silver is, this is my Sky Plus box. It's not particularly big as you can see, but seems absolutely massive with the silver on top. A look at the rear shows just how neat and tidy the new Sky Q is, even with those unused USBs and covered ports. Onto the Sky Q Mini, which is where the system really starts to get interesting. The silver can stream to two minis simultaneously. You can watch live TV, any of your recordings from the silver box, or on demand stuff. The remote isn't Bluetooth, it's a standard IR controller, which means nice clickable buttons. You can also use this to control the bigger silver box. There's also a power lead bonus paper. There's no instruction manual. You can connect multiple SkyQ minis to the main silver box, but remember only two can stream simultaneously. So this is the mini which lives up to its name. There's an embossed Sky logo on the top. The front has a WPS button to link to the silver box. On the rear there's an optical audio output, HDMI and covered Ethernet. Most will use Wi-Fi. You can't watch 4K through a Mini though, it's HD only. So that's Sky Q Unboxed, which I think looks really cool. Thanks for watching. For more of the same, please subscribe.